Hello, everyone. Sensational news from tech world this week. OpenAI rolled out its flagship model of ChatGPT three months later, right after the release of Sora. Today, we're gonna take a look at this newest model, which I would say is game changing. As most of you don't know, I'm a former ITer, and I used to be in a department of smart hardwares several years ago. And we always cast as the movie Her as the ultimate version and experience that AI would offer to human beings when it comes to teasing out the AI capability and what we could achieve in our products based on the current,、um, no, I mean, and then technology. But look what happened within two or three years. Especially if you have seen those showcases of ChatGPT 4.0 in real-life examples, you'll find that the movie Her is about to come true. So there are two things you're gonna know about OpenAI Spring Update. One is ChatGPT 4.0. The other one, which I care about most, is what capabilities are for free for people like me and you. And let's check them out through the official website. Introducing GPT 4.0 and making more capabilities available for free in ChatGPT. Yeah, they're exactly what I want to know. This is OpenAI Spring Update streamed live videos on Monday. It's only 26 minutes long and it's pretty interactive and hilarious. So if you had time, make sure to check out this video so you could get the gist of the new features of ChatGPT 4.0. All right. Let's click the first one. We're announcing GPT-4.0, our new flagship model that can reason across audio, vision, text in real time. Flagship model, 旗舰版的模型 I assume that most of you access reason as a verb by the collocation reason with someone, which means argue with someone. In a context, it means that the model can work things out through audio, vision, and text. In real time, what is real time? Real time means instantaneously. It's right here, right now. You can interact with one another. 实时的 Let's get to know the name of ChatGPT 4.0. O is for Omni. Omni is the prefix of all or everywhere and everything. You must be familiar with the else vocabulary: omnivore, 杂食动物 and omnipotent, 全能的 And GPT-4.0 is a step towards much more natural human-computer interaction. It accepts any inputs as a combination of text, audio, image, and video, and generates any combinations of text, audio, and image outputs. There are model abilities in showcases, which cover various real-time scenarios, such as singing, interview prep, sarcasm, learning language, real-time translation, and lullaby, etc. I think the key word of GPT-4.0 is real time. Of course, we can have conversations with the earlier version of ChatGPT, but the mechanism of ChatGPT-4.0 is totally different from the earlier versions. We trained a single new model end to end across text, vision, and audio. End to end, 终端对终端的，就是语音对语音 There is no need to transcribe between different forms of speech. An example is when we are having a natural conversation with one another. It is common that people chime in or interrupt your speech. GPT 3.5 or 4 won't stop until it finishes what it had to say. It's pretty annoying, actually. But in GPT 4.0, when you chime in or interrupt the conversation, it will stop immediately and listen to what you are saying and redirect its attention to your new topic. The next one is the explorations of capabilities. You can click the dropout menu, and for example, you have this visual narratives here, and you can input a few sentences, and it'll output with an image, or maybe this one photo to capture, 把一个图像变成漫画 You can play around with those samples.、So、just try them out. Next is model evaluations. There are some benchmarks to evaluate the performance of GPT-4.0. Through the lens of metrics such as、uh, text valuation, audio performance, audio translation, and vision understanding valves. Next feature is language tokenization. That tokenization, 之前讲过啦，代币或者是令牌，实际上这里指的就是支持了某种语言 And we're glad to see that Chinese has been included into ChatGPT 4.0. The next one is model safety and the limitations, and there are some limitations in the current version of GPT-4.0. Let's check out this video. So let's root, root, root for the home. 
Et après les chansons, elle oh a dit Oh non Comment ça Sorry, guys. I got carried away. So yeah, you did. <laughs> <laughs> Guilty as charged. What can I say? Sometimes I just can't help myself. Ça délai est à quel signe de San Francisco? Fique ça à ne? San Francisco, c'est une très bonne ville. <laughs> it's pretty awkward, like a social faux pas. Despite that, GPT-4.0 had this situation and tried to resolve the embarrassment quite naturally, I said. And next, one of the things you care about most is model availability. Is it available to download? Yes, it is. GPT-4.0's test and image capabilities are starting to roll out today. We're making GPT-4.0 available in the free tier and to plus users with up to 5x higher message limits. 对于普通用户来讲，基本上是免费的，但是呢，是有一定上限的。但是对于付费用户来讲，它这个上限会设置的比较高。I'm not sure how many prompts I could input before I hit the paywall. And we will roll out a new version of voice mode of GPT-4.0 in alpha within GPT Plus in the coming weeks. 这种语音对话的 alpha 版本将会在未来的几个星期内上线到 GPT Plus 用户。And next, we're going to see the tools for free users. When using GPT-4.0, GPT free users will now have access to features such as experienced GPT-4 level intelligence. That's good news for having using GPT-3.5 for free. Get responses from both models and web. Analyze data and create charts. Chat about photos you take and upload files for assistance summarizing, writing, and、uh, analyzing. Brilliant! Discover and use GPTs in GPT stores. I don't know what it is. Wow! It, like this one, it, it's just like an Apple Store or Chrome extensions. And build a more helpful experience with memory, where a list of the previous topics are saved. For both free and pay users, we're also launching a new ChatGPT desktop app for macOS that is designed to integrate seamlessly into anything you're doing on your computer. So, how about Windows? Don't you know that Microsoft is one of the biggest investors and shareholders of、uh, OpenAI? Well, oh, here I found this one. We also plan to launch a Windows version later this year. For Windows users like me, we have to wait. Let's take a simplified look and feel for GPT-4.0. It's pretty much like what we're doing in a website, except for it is、um, a client that you have to install. So this is it about ChatGPT-4.0. If you are interested in and what is capable of, make sure to watch this、uh, 26 minutes video to experience this newest phenomenal and mind-blowing model of ChatGPT. And this is headlines. I'm Zoe, and I'll see you next time.